everyone, I hope you are well. My name is Nick, we're on ZX Spectrum 48K, and we're loading up a football management game called British Super League, which was uh, published by Colt Games in 1989, and was budget release at £2.99. So it came out one year after Tracksuit Manager from Goliath Games in 1988. Input your name. Well, I always say I'm Nick at the start, but my real name is Nicky. Uh, some people might know that anyway. I will edit down some of the loading times, especially at the uh, start. Now, there's 16 teams in this game. We must pick one of them to take them to uh, glory. So let's just pick Rangers. Looks like it's England and um, Scotland mixed into one. Uh, let's enter the new name of our team. Let's go for Big Nose United. Yay! Go Big Nose United. Boo! Oh no, no, Big Nose FC. Let's do that. That's easier. Right. Okay. Big Nose FC. I change at the last second. This game also came out on the Amtrad CPC and the Commodore 64. So buy and sell players. Um, yes. Now, first of all, I think it's randomising which players in the database go to which teams. So you might recognise top players of the day in the wrong team. Why is it doing this? I don't know. Uh, you can buy and sell players to increase your uh, side. It's the first time I've had a go of this ever, so I am seeing it new, as possibly you are. But it looks like it's taken a little while to actually get into the game completely. Right. Hmm. Uh, so we'll see how we get on with this one. So not uh, Expert gameplay, as I say, all about seeing how you would have got on with the game your first or second go. Uh, management games tend to um, involve lots of databases going on underneath the uh, hood, but we'll see how enjoyable it is and how much control we've got over this compared to other football management games which were to come a bit later on. So you're managing a team, you've got to win cups over numerous seasons, but um, prevent yourself from getting uh, sacked. Now I do know you can select your team when it actually loads up there and depending on what players you've got in this starting 11 that will determine what formation you're doing whether it's a 4-4-2, 4-3-3 or whatever so it's not actually going to, um, there's no default setting to change your uh, formation it's just what players are in the team, they automatically go there so here's all the selections here, we'll have a look at squad you can save it at any point, so it's quite basic in its presentation but that's what I would have expected, so here's the team Kendall, Hurst, Bowman, Pearson, Hinson, Glover, Hunt, Gibbon, Nicole, uh, Nicole, I mean, Vidi, Howe and McGrain. We've got Gascoigne in the substitute bench. And now I do know that he's a rather good player. So we need to get him into the team, unless we use him as a super sub. So S to swap players. Um, right, which player do we want to swap? Let's take out number six, Glover, not to dinner, and replace him with the Paul Gascoigne. If you want to play a rubbish football game, then Gaza is Gaza Super Soccer and Gaza 2 are the ones for you. We have reviewed those, but this isn't about Gaza. This is about Big Nose FC. Uh, not sure how many um, cups they won historically. The uh, Gascoigne right wing, well, he's more central, wasn't he? 100% fit. Previous club Chelsea, well, that's wrong as well. We can keep or sell him. Okay, now I'll be interested to see if you get any stats for the players here. It looks like a lot of your success might be a little bit random. I mean, it's a major achievement, no transfer this week. It's a major achievement to get any football tactical management game playing on an 8-bit system because of the limited memory. Uh, director support, 7 or 4, no against. Uh, if 4 directors turn against you, more than half the board, you will get sacked. So you don't want to do that. Uh, here's the league so far. Uh, so Celtic, uh, a few, yes, yeah, so the Scottish teams and English teams make up the League of 16 and Big Nose FC as well. Can't wait to see their uh, merchandise. Please subscribe if you haven't already, and a big thank you to those people who have subscribed so far. Managerial games always a little bit of a struggle to turn into an entertaining video, but hopefully I can do okay. Right, so that asterisk, uh, we can, um, if you want to see any of the other games, uh, they're live on our screen. We can uh, opt for those, but we're just going to show our own ones, otherwise the video will probably take too long. Just going to give you a gist of the mechanics of how this thing works. So it's drawing the pitch. Um, yes, yeah, so I think I prefer Tracksuit Manager at this point, but this was a year later. Cult Games, good to have a selection. So Big Nose FC at home to Chelsea. Right, there's, there's our formations there. That's where all the players are. We'll flash on which one's got the ball and um, parts of the pitch will go brighter depending on where the play is, where the action is. Come on, big nose. Come on, big nose. The referee's uh, Pope hurts on the ball. 
Now I know already um, at the end of the match or even half time, you don't get ratings for your players uh, during the game. Uh, there, so it's a bit hard to see who's doing. Oh, I scored already. It's a bit hard to see who's doing well and who's not doing well. So you've got to try and determine how often their name appears up on the uh, screen there to see how much the ball they're getting and how many goals they've got. Now Connor has already scored a goal for Chelsea. We're one nil down. Uh, by pressing S, you can see it's highlighted there. We can do a substitute at any point. At this time in football history, you can only do well. You only have two substitutions, and uh, you can uh, bring them on. Right, come on, let's try and get some uh, goals. Uh, you see the time ticking up. That's per minute. There'll be 90 minutes during the match. It's, it's going at a, an okay speed without going super super fast. Other management games that Colt um, Games did, uh, they did quite a few, but we've reviewed Banger Racer, which is strange, where you uh, turn up as a, a, a Banger Racer type driver and you have to go up the leagues there. That's interesting too. This one is a little bit dull for people that aren't into football or soccer, but if you was into it, you could get heavily involved into this game. Yeah, it looks like to get anywhere in the leagues, it's going to take you quite a lot of time of, of play. But uh, yeah, I mean, I like this um, this map here, uh, which is in a bit of the play. I was, I'm a little bit excited to see if we can score a goal. I'd like to see the program going on behind this. There's a lot of random going on with your stats and stuff. But uh, it's a shame we, um, you know, we uh, let in that first goal. We're in the second half now. I thought it was going to break for half time, but it hasn't. So you see the time's in the 50th minute. But the ZX Spectrum will be uh, heating up big style if you ever want to play a league here. Especially if you had the 48k Spectrum, which I had here. So uh, try and make up your own Big Nose chant for Big Nose FC. Right, I'm going to do a substitution. Uh, which player do you want to put on? Well, okay. Let's put on... Uh, who can we put on? We'll put on Glover. So it's another attacking player to try and get that goal. We can take off whoever we want. Might take off McGrain, or should we take off Hunt? We're taking off Hunt, right? So we've got an extra striker on the pitch. So I think we might have gone to a 4-2-4 now. The computer's randomising it up, redrawing the people in their positions. Uh, so you can't say attack more, or defend more, or anything like that. It's fairly basic in that regard, but it's doing the basics of football okay. If I had this back in the day as a kid, despite it looks very sparse and rubbish now, I think I would have given it some time at least. It's the British Super League. Yes, here we go. Can't get much more British uh, than this. Bib, 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 bib. Some people will think this extremely boring. Um, there's no real reason to go back and play it now, unless you're trying to learn how to do programming and stuff, want to get an idea historically of where things are. Out of the two, I prefer ta uh, Tracksuit Manager. We haven't reviewed a great deal of uh, football management games on the ZX Spectrum, but Tracksuit Manager is slightly ahead of this one, but that is international uh, football. It's just that that one gives commentary on what's going on in the game. Here you've got to follow this, this map instead, and it will just tell you Cole. So there's no, there's no commentary, so to speak. So it's a little bit lacklustre in that respect. I think future football management games, especially on the Commodore Amiga and beyond, would all be heavily into their, their commentary. Right, Bib. Come on, lads. We we, we can maybe do this. We're only one nil down. The fellow big noses. I'd like to see what our mascot is. Probably someone dressed up as a great big nose. If you're currently walking around dressed up as a great big nose, then comment in the comment section below because you could be signed as a mascot for Big Nose FC. Not to get confused with Big Nose United, who are down the road. Right. Uh, Celtic 2, Tottenham 2, Newcastle 0, Man United 0. Oh, I feel like that bloke back in the day reading out the football results. Nods Forest 0, Arsenal 1, Coventry 0, Liverpool 2, Dungeon United 0, Everton 2, Aberdeen, Aber Aberdeen? No, Aberdeen 0, Hearts 0. And uh, Plymouth against um, uh, Big Bottom Town is a late kickoff. Okay, right, so. So uh, yeah, so that was how a game is played. We won't play too many, so I'm pretty much telling you how the game uh, sort of like plays. Let's see what other options there are here, and then we'll get out of here. Um, so where's the league so far? Liverpool won, Everton won, they all won up there. I lost, but I'm in 13th place, because I only lost by a single goal. Uh, uh, goal scorers so far in the league? No one. Why isn't that updated? Maybe it's just my own goal scorers, and so far of those, there is none. So what I need to do is uh, find out who's scoring the most goals and with my money hopefully get them into my team. So it's a quest to find all the best players. 
Um, you know, people who have played this game before will know who the best players are so far. Here's the Liverpool side, got Gordon Jury, he's quite a useful striker. Um, so he will be quite good. Yes. Uh, there we go. Left wing, they've got him on. He's not available for transfer, though. You could edit his name. So if I wanted to, I could call him uh, Smelly Big Bum. But I won't do. I can keep to be a jury. Okay. Right. Uh, that wouldn't that wouldn't sell a, a many um, uh, jerseys, would it? In in the in the shop, uh, a football shirt with Smelly Big Bum written on it. Anyway, never mind. So what else is there? That's pretty much it, isn't it? I don't think there's too much more we can see. Managerial status we've done, transfers we've done. So there we go. And uh, there's the big nose team. So we'll leave it there. An interesting one. Um, you know, seems to be missing uh, stats, but you have to try and learn who's doing what. So it's okay, really, about being spectacular. So I hope you liked having a look at that one. That was British Super League on the ZX Spectrum 48K, published by Colt Games in 1989. Just 2.99, so you could have a few seasons of fun with it, eat up a few uh, summer holidays there. So if you've got any comments about this uh, game, similar games, or anything retro, then please put that below. You're more than welcome. Until next time, take great care of yourself and a very fond goodbye. Goodbye. Come on, big nose. Come on, big nose. The referees, uh, Nincompope, Lots Forest nil, Arsenal one, Coventry nil, Liverpool two, and uh, Plymouth against um, uh, Big Bottom Town is a late kickoff.